Hello, Mr. Francis. Hi. Can I have five minutes of your time? Uh, yeah, sure. But I'm on the way to a meeting at the Moot Court. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. All right. Tell us about yourself. What is your current role and what does that involve? Um, I'm a lecturer with the Faculty of, the, uh, Faculty of Law here in Multimedia University. Uh, that generally means a lot of things. Um, my job principally is academic in nature, which means uh, teaching classes, um, exams, assignments, uh, revising syllabi, because we are constantly revising and updating our syllabus. Uh, but then again, there's also an aspect of being a lecturer that people don't, generally don't know. Uh, that has to do with a lot of other things. Examples include like uh, researching new and uh, existing areas of law, um, there's this initiative by the Ministry of Education uh, to make entrepreneurs of the new generation of students that we are uh, working very hard at uh, trying to achieve as well. Uh, and also things like uh, organizing uh, legal awareness programs. We do a lot of that, yeah. Uh, in addition, personally for me, what's on my table include things like uh, I, I refurbished, uh, sorry, I, I didn't refurbish, but I managed the refurbishment and uh, uh, reconstruction of the moot court that we're walking to right now. Uh, so that was a lot of work. Also, at the same time, I'm looking at websites. Uh, so these are just some of the things that are on my table. I see. Yeah. All right. What inspired you to come into the teaching profession? Ah, well, um, I found that I've got a greater sense of self and uh, fulfillment teaching as compared to when I was. Uh, practicing law and you'll find that this is common with uh, the other lecturers here as well we are here because we want to teach we're here because uh, we choose to teach uh, and in, in addition to that I found that uh, I'm good at taking large amounts of information and breaking it up to smaller chunks that's easier for for students to be able to understand which means that's really good for the teaching learning process so I found it was a natural progress for me to come here yeah how do you feel your teaching style serves your students? Uh, I don't know, you'll have to ask them. Uh, I just hope that what I'm doing for them is helpful. Okay, all right. Tell us something interesting about yourself that's not on your resume. I was, sorry, I came here four years ago and uh, I started practicing yoga. Uh, that's not something that people normally know about me. Okay. What do you see as the major challenges of being a lecturer and how would you meet them? Um, it's a lot of work, this place, uh, and it's a lot, very varied uh, array of work, which means um, you're constantly having to change roles. One moment you could be preparing for a lecture class next week, and the next thing you realize you will be designing a t-shirt for the faculty. So, you know, you just smile and get on with it. So, Mr. Francis, please share your advice or tips for the freshmen. Um, my advice would be make full use of your time while you're here. Uh, study hard because obviously that's what you're here for. Um, but at the same time, uh, live your life to the fullest. Uh, make lifelong friendships and bonds. Uh, don't be boring. Go out and do stuff. Um, yeah, that's it. So, right. so I've got a meeting now. Oh, okay. Anything else? No, that's all. Thank you for your time, Mr. Francis. All right. No problem. Cool.